All right, guys, welcome back. Joe here from Gamer Toys, and uh, let's do another pickup video, shall we? In the last pickup video, I said that these two were the ones I wanted, and I found them. Save the best for last year. So this is the Range Trooper. In the last pickup video, I couldn't remember his name. It's the Range Trooper. This guy's a little hefty. This is the guy with the uh, RoboCop feet, which is awesome which I guess are like some kind of gravity or anti-gravity boots or magnetic boots or something. But he looks like some kind of trooper. Like he looks like the hover tank pilot mixed with a snow trooper with a scarf. It's amazing and I love it. So the range trooper is one of my favorite troopers now. Um, he might take over the throne from the scarif trooper, which I love the scarif troopers. This guy is amazing. I can't say enough great things about this figure. Lando Calrissian from Solo, you guys can see here. Let's get rid of that glare. This guy is amazing. Look at that face sculpt. Like I said, the new technology they use is amazing. His expression on his face right here, which I don't know if I'll be able to get you guys to see it because it's gonna be blurry, but it's awesome. I love that yellow shirt, the black and yellow, man. It's just, it's perfect. It comes with a bright silver blaster. And come on, Donald Glover, he's gonna kill it. We already know that. From the trailers, we know he's gonna kill it. I have some more Jurassic Park or Jurassic World goodness here. This is just a mercenary with a dimorphid on. Uh, this kind of looks like a G.I. Joe guy right here. He's pretty sweet looking though. And he comes with a dimorphid on. He's got some kind of like taser weapon here, I'm assuming, which is pretty sweet. This packaging I like a little bit more than the Legacy packaging. Less cluttered. It doesn't have a T-Rex up in the corner. It just has the logo with like kind of like a caged uh, motif there with a erupting volcano in the back, which is awesome. I kind of wish they would have maybe kept this cage design, but put a different background in and had the Jurassic Park logo right there for the Legacy Collection. That might have worked better, but that's okay. On the back here, it shows a couple shows a couple Chris Pratt's and uh, Claire with her Stegosaurus actually, which is awesome. So the first Owen figure I have is Trainer Owen. He comes with what looks like a Jurassic World riot shield and some armor. It's a pretty cool figure and he comes with a, uh, no, he doesn't come with a hatchling. So he only comes with his armor. Figures aren't that bad. The face sculpts, I mean, it doesn't look like Chris Pratt, but you can kind of see what they were going for. I just grabbed it because I wanted it and I'm probably gonna get all the humans. Uh, it's the same back, right, is it the same? No, this one has the, uh, the mercenary on the back of this one here. Cool figure. And uh, this one's probably my favorite one because this Owen comes with baby blue. You're my boy, blue. And he comes with his uh, bag and it looks like a knife. I like the paint apps. Even the paint on blue looks pretty cool. He's got yellow eyes, he's got the blue stripe, obviously. You gotta have the blue stripe. And uh, like I said, back's the same. Cool figure. All right, guys, uh, that was short and sweet, but that's all I have for today for this uh, pickup episode. I'm glad to be back in the swing of things here, so make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.